All right, so welcome back to another episode, yeah, guys. So yeah, in the last episode, there was this talent competition between Geo, Chica, Don, and Lumi, bro. Lumi ended up losing the the talent show, bro. And and in the progress, everybody everybody got gassed, and Lumi ended up disappearing. So we're still trying to find her, yeah, guys. So let's see if we can find her in this episode. Let's do this shit. Tough morning. Still no sign from Lumi. We did all we could. Let's just drop it. There's no way she just ran away with her phone when she doesn't answer. Exactly. One of you. I think she. Not what I meant, but sure, Queen. If none of you are talking and taking responsibility, then I know who will. This is your last chance to confess before I contact the producers. Silence. Yeah, retreat to a corner. Now we wait. Trust me. Well, she's kind of very invested in this. I think she's Didn't invested. Didn't we were so close? One moment we are all at fault, the next, Lumi ran away instead. She's trying to figure out what happened, but I think she got it wrong. A waste of the producer's time. By all means, go ahead. She'll love to hear Maria's pleas. Who are you talking about? Have you forgotten we're in the hands of the producers? Oh! Gio and Sasha had a gazing moment there. What's going on? Sasha! She's coming back. OMG, so excited. So? Well, where is she? They want more than I have to offer. I'll put on speakerphone. Ahem. As I was saying. Unfortunately, the mere offer to do a favor is not accepted anymore. As it is already several months into your island adventure, our viewers need more than just a mysterious favor. Not to mention some of you have been very generous with your deals. Inflation hits everything, even our show. Plus, it's industry standard. Always about things up. Don't blame us, blame your society that always wants like, let me handle this then. What if I set up a totally tubular, super duper wild party, get everyone drunk, and we share some intimate secrets? Winky face. Interesting idea. I will send over a tattoo machine. If those secrets end up on everyone's faces, we have a deal. Listen, I love tattoos. In fact, I even have a super secret tattoo. But I am not tattooing my effing gorge face. Bro, well, but like, face tattoos look fucking ugly on anyone, no matter who, no matter how you spin it, bro. We can get Gio to tattoo his dick. Oh shit. Here comes him. Oh damn. Hey, uh, what now? We're not tattooing our secrets on our faces. That's unacceptable. I just want to know who hurt you. Please. Was it one of us? Who? Why? Take a No! You didn't hear? We're about to experiment on bones and squirms. And can you not until we see someone blowing eyes out over some deep shit? Well, if any of you got abandoned at a bus stop by your parents, now's your time. I've got a backup wig and extra padding. <laughs> yeah, Would that be all? This is a waste of time. Hurry, let's just try and look for clues, please. We would make for a great investigation team. I know it. If someone threatened her, she's certainly hiding somewhere. The narrative doesn't fit at all. The show. Well, I don't think so. I don't think she ran, nor was she harmed after all. Viewers want drama, chaos, backstabs, not gore. Naomi said it before. Now come after my job! Well, you was the one that said it before, so... You should have never said it in the first place. <clears throat> Which makes me think, I know what was happened to Lumi. What? She got removed from the show. That was the punishment for losing. Yeah, she she probably just got removed from the show as a result of a punishment, bro. 
say yeah. Let's be honest. She was an incredibly boring contestant for the, for, the, for the viewers, yeah. Yeah, to be fair, Louis was pretty boring and forgettable, bruh. Hell, honestly, there have been times where I even forgot that she exists in the, in the show, bruh. Like, to me, I feel like everyone else had, like, played their part in the show, bruh. But, I feel like Louis is one person that everybody pretty much forgets about, bruh. That is in, even in the show, bruh. Now, there are bound to be forgettable contestants in any competition show in general, bruh. Just take a look at Tojama. They have their fair share of forgettable contestants. Most of, most of these forgettable people come from either Pocket Tail or Redongless Race, bruh. So, yeah. Nobody wants to hurt Lumi. Nobody had any arguments with her either. Lumi was just too quiet. She didn't have a big personality. That was the problem. Fascinating. All while we were auditioning for the role of Sleeping Beauty. I need not divine this. You truly believe Bagel did it, don't you? <sighs> of course not. Are we done here? We got all the shit to do, Island Sleuth. Give me some credit. I figured this one out. Something happened to Lumi. She certainly didn't run away. Something happened indeed! She got eliminated! You said it yourself! Yep, so... Lumi's punishment was, was... Was that she was getting removed from the show, bro. So now there's only ten of us remaining, bro. On the island, bro. Unfortunate souls often fade away. Such is the fate for those who are unwanted by the island and its people. We wanted her. You... you... Oh, yes. Leave it to Mia to insult me. You Good. deserve it, Ombre. You have a hand in Lumi's removal now, I'm sure of it. Uh, what? She had told everyone before. He's sexy villain. I only held the door open. Nothing more, nothing less. Sasha's trying to steal the show. This is my time to shine, Blade House. Kling. How do you know that, Sasha? Did you make a deal with the producers? Are you the inflation? Fuck off! All the way off. Then get to smash the window, but I for sure heard Isak's bling before passing out. Probably the bandit. He was too well looking the morning of the gassing. He knew all of this was gonna happen. He didn't stop the henchmen. He probably even helped them. Probably to gain immunity from the gassing. Or maybe that was his reward for being at the top. Huh? Henchman? They took her. Don't know exactly where, but I'm sure of it. How about, like, these henchmen also take me home? There's no other explanation. Outsider, indeed. A speedboat could come and go in less than an hour. Although, how did Whoa. they take her away? Speedboat, you say? This is making me more nauseous than I already am. Oh, well, who cares? <laughs> What's that about to be? If only people would cooperate, there would be no need for gas. No denying. Guess you're guilty. Luby had so much potential. If only she would have followed my path. You have my consent to hurt him now, Giovanni. <gasps> but wait! I think the fuck not! Anybody talk to them, you're all snitfoes! What was the thing with no rules? For real. Don't you even dare, filthy peasants! I see what is going on. I will remind you there is still more than a month on the island. We cannot allow you to harm contestant Isaac in any way. I suggest you return to your routine. <laughs> what the fuck? I told you, I am protected by higher powers. We'll get to you, Isaac. I promise you that. I tremble. Someone take care of Harry Bob there. He looks pale. <sighs> yeah, I haven't been able to eat properly. Don't really know what's going on. I'll go rest for an hour. Maybe it'll go away. That's it? Nothing done about Lumi or Isaac? 
Battle lost, but not the war. Go rest, Harrison. Damn, bro. On my head. Okay, what's going on? Headache, dizziness, sore throat. Haven't felt like this in a few months. Not since. Not since I got sick last summer. I think I might be getting sick. Is there such a thing as jungle flu? Better inform the rest. They should know I'm not feeling well. And speaking of rest, probably some good sleep after. Maybe sweet Ani will help make some chicken soup. Hey, I meant, I, meant, I meant to tell you that I'm not feeling well. I think I might be having a flu or something similar. Is that or something stomach or some stomach bug? Lumi would have known what to do. Try rest, drink lots of liquid. Maybe it'll pass soon. I will take care of you. I'll take an early evening and see how I feel tomorrow. Rest well, mate. Be well, Hari. A number of days passed by, bro. Wow. A whopping eight days passed, bro. I has been worrying how Harry is doing. Still better than I lived. I need got some books from the delivery. I need will come and read them to you. I like that. Thanks. What about Mia? How are you feeling? Feeling a bit better. He said, I'm sure why. I was thinking if we could play some cards. I could do that. I'll get some snacks and see you then. <laughs> We're gonna feel great. I greatly appreciate all the help everyone gave me. Time went fast playing card games with Mia. Anika reading stories for me was heartwarming. Right. So relieved. Yesterday I was okay. But now I feel unstoppable. This is, and this ha, and this is, and all this has reunited my spark, my love for these people. Whoa. Haven't forgotten about you either, viewers. I know you're eager, eager to see what I'm going to do next. I love you all just as much. Oh, I almost forgot the care packages I got from viewers. Sure. And thank you for whoever sent the care packages. He might be anonymous, but my heart knows. What it knows. I have a good chance I end up first in this row. I feel it. The only thing holding me back was missing another social game. If it was unfair, I couldn't participate. If only I wasn't so sick. Hmm. Giovanni won 100k, bro. Yeah, there was a, yeah, there's a social game that Harrison ended up missing. So, yeah. Everyone was so vague and telling me what was the game like? Dares, challenges. I could have easily done them too. I hope this doesn't ch change how the viewers see me. What if the girls start flocking to that muscle mass instead? Who cares? <sighs> Can't let this get to me. Get to get Harrison. Catch up with, wh with what the current state is. Get back in the loop. I have, I have to check out on the bracelet situation too. That will help me with some audience points. Everyone would be delighted to see my love story blooming. First thing first, I walk around. After so many days of just laying in bed, the sand feels amazing under my feet. Thank you so much for coming with me. Mia hesitated, hesitated when I took her in. Why would she pull back? You know, despite everything that happened, I do care for you. No, listen! I love you! You know I do! I know, Harry. I... You have to understand, I can't be what you want me to be. Huh? Yeah, we can... Love you. Uh, but I want you. I need you in my life. You're beautiful. You're caring. You're exactly what I'm looking for. He pulled my hand away again. 
Try to kiss her. I want us to be happy together, to stroke your cheek and and to kiss your lips. I want. I want to feel your lips against mine, to embrace you and know you are mine. Swift kiss, with the tip of my tongue, playful, short, but filled with love for you. This is it now. She slapped me. My cheek feels so hot, hot strings. <laughs> Damn. Just butcher my feelings, my request. Have I not told you so many times? I thought, I Damn. thought it was my fault. If I would have had different clothes, I could have done something different. Look away, smile less. Something I said, perhaps. Something I didn't say. You are exactly like him, Harrison. You make me feel I wronged you. You make me feel what friendship I had to offer was not enough. But that's not the case, is it? You push and push and push. What could I possibly do for you to comprehend? Why are you so against dating me? What have I done to you? I, I'm trying to understand you and, and you paint me as a villain. That's not what friends do. Friends understand boundaries and limits. You want something that isn't there. My... My friendship is not enough for you. Mia, I would teach you what love is. I'm not like some... Duh, anyone else you're thinking about. I'm not some monster. You are. You have been for weeks now. Maybe months. And I have been a fool. Instead of seeking compassion, unity and empathy. Helping each other in this horrible, dreadful scenario. To survive together, to... Maybe finally find a way to escape. You chased Eva's bikini and Annika's bra, and then you defile me. You revolt me, Harrison. Don't Damn. ever speak to me again. Mia. She stormed off. Why is she so aggressive? It was just a kiss. All my feelings are of love, and she treats me like trash. No matter. If you're not willing to share my love, Mia, there are others who are. I'll show you what it means to have me as a partner. You lost me a, a great loss. <laughs> Heart's being like crazy. Isaac's finally done with the breath with the bracelet. And what perfect timing too. This will make me forget all last week. Hope hope for a far future. Can't wait to see it. They are at last. I came as fast as I could. So excited. Can I see it? You are eager to accept my craft, but have you forgotten our agreement? Agreement. Oh yes, the favor. Sure. What do you want? I own. I owe him a favor for making the bracelet. Wonder how did he even make a bracelet on this island? He must have have some tools in his room. You can't the sky is dark. Fathom. The moon's pale. Soon the Emperor of Hollows shall claim his place. Soon I shall ascend. Yeah, bro. When the time is right, I require a confession from you something you saw you will know what you have to say your memory will not betray you huh play hell i didn't have any idea what you're talking about let alone what am i supposed to say despite that he seems confident in his plan his what could he possibly want to confess seeing Oh, the you seem lost. Free, fret not, little acolyte. You'll have the final chance to serve, to serve soon. All will be revealed, thus I vow, warrior of darkness. For now, here, your symbol of despair. Right. This bracelet. Damn, bro.
So yeah. There was, that was a nail. Bent into a bracelet. It seems elegant and well crafted. Yeah, bro. Those look like those are like moons on it. Very Nordic. Yeah, bro. Gorgeous, but why a nail? Do you mean? Do you mean with despair? Say so, yeah. Now, for use when one wants to secure something, in this case, love. All you need is a hammer. Sure. So, so correct. That'll be all. I have places to be, people to see. Mate. Thanks a lot, Isaac. I would have thought, I would have thought Isaac might have figured out that I helped Giovanni and Don. For real, bro. Seems he did. So yeah. I think Isaac continues. Seems to be an ally, bro. Yeah, Mia gets pissed over. Harrison wanted a relationship with. With where are bro? So yeah. Which is great news. I can still use him and his connections while they last. As long as he's on top, I'm close to it. This bracelet will seal the spot at the top. If not, the round, the next. The, the audience will love it. Hmm. Is one ready? No, I'll go back to sleep. heart pulls in so many directions. I have to make a decision the much I know, but who? I love everyone equally, at least I think I do. Don't think I'll ever get anywhere with Sasha and they're not the loyal type. Loyal type. Having Anika would be like an Iolaic romance story. Partying with Eva would be like no other celebration. I swear, I always feel weak. Like I'm melting with Ch in Chica's presence. I don't think any of them are going to make the first move. I don't want to wait much longer. How? Who knows how the wheels turn? One thing's for certain. I'll give them a br the bracelet. It's going to be some heartbreaks. But oh, wait. I got an idea. What would happen if I were to agree with Mia as a friend, bruh? Say what? After so friend. many days of just laying yeah. in bed, the sand feels amazing under my high, feet. High fast forward, bro. Okay, RT. I know how it. Let's happen if they oh. decide on friendship. I was hoping I could change your mind. It's hard to grab these feelings and just. Sweep them under the rug, I guess. I want you to know that I will always be there for you if you need me. Mia, yeah, why do you look so sad all of a sudden? I am the one heartbroken here. Every man I see reminds me of my past. Everyone looks at me with eyes of lust. Maybe it's something I did wrong. Something I still do wrong. The way I talk, perhaps I smile too much. We had talk so not too much. I don't understand. I, I'm sorry, I can't match your feelings, but I'm sure you'll find someone who will. If that's the case, why aren't you happy for me now? You know I've been seeing other people here. I think there's a strong chance for a beautiful love story to unfold. 
This isn't a lover's paradise, Harrison. I've watched you chase them, and not just the women, but you chased. You crave attention from the viewers as well. Long gone are the days when I still hoped we could escape. Fight back against the producers and do something. Too late for that now. I can't help it, Mia. I did what my heart desired. I don't think it's fair that he who accused me. But I'm happy. At least I think I am. I would appreciate it if you could be happy with me. I will try. I promise you that. Just try to remind yourself that I'm your friend. Nothing else. So, friends? <laughs> yeah. Best friends. The hands are cold, but though a knot. I don't understand why Mia is so against dating me. I honestly think I like this decision more than the other one, bro. Basically, Mia, all that Mia wants is more of a pl pl of a pl shit. All that she really wants is more of a platonic relationship with Harrison, bro. I like how at some point in my life, Spark will reinitiate, reignite, and show no love again. Her sweet tears from his heart and mind. But at least there will be someone else on Ellen who tend to my wound. And the lighthouse scene is just the same one that we've seen, bro. You know, we just, we saw this one before, bro. So, yeah. So yeah. I think I like the second option, the other option way more with the Mia one. So, yeah. So, I'm, I saved that. That'll be it for today's episode. See you guys next time. Our series sign off.